Turn that puppy on, baby. That just tickles. That just tickles me. <laughs> Hello and welcome, guys. Welcome to Nine Strange Walmart gifts and they are weird items. At least I assume so because Brian picked them out. Am I right? <laughs> Guys, also make sure you click that bell icon next to my channel name on desktop and on mobile to get notified when I upload videos because when I do, I will be commenting back for the first 30 minutes. So make sure you comment, like, and question, ask me real questions. Don't like beg for replies because I do not respond to those. And I also can't respond to every single one. You guys, in the first 30 minutes, you guys are commenting like 4,000 comments. There's like no way, but I'm gonna do my best to comment back as many times as I possibly can. Okay, but before we begin the video, I just wanted to let you know that this video is sponsored by Best Fiends. What is Best Fiends? I'm about to tell you, yo. If you haven't heard already, Best Fiends Forever is the second edition to the trilogy of Best Fiends. It's the same story with the same characters, but it's a completely, totally different game with completely, totally different gameplay. Best Fiends Forever is, I'm gonna tell you right now, it's, it's an addictive game. It's an addictive clicker game where you pretty much slap, collect, and level up every single aspect of the game. Level up, level up, level up, level up before we were shooting, I was like, hold on, hold on, hold on. I gotta keep playing, dude, hold on. I sat here for five minutes just watching <laughs> you play that game. And I'm, like, and I'm like, oh. They're introducing limited time events where you can win special rewards and it all starts with slugs in space. Coming to you December 22nd. But look how many coins I have, 520K. I'm rich. Also make sure you connect the game to Facebook. That way you're gonna be able to compete with all your friends and show them how much of a better clicker you are and a slug destroyer. Die slug. Die. Oh, he's a pirate. Did I mention that it's free? Click that link in the description below. Download it, get slapping, get cracking, get collecting. 0 0.06 million coins, instant. <laughs> so now on to the rest of the video. Ooh, what's this? Captain America Civil War? I'm sorry, but that wasn't the best like Captain America or Iron Man movie. And let's be honest, I watched it twice, right? <laughs> it wasn't nearly as good as like, let's say, you know, Iron Man 1. It's, it's like a, a Nerf. Nerf gun? Is it actually? Oh, it is Nerf. Look, it's actually yeah. Nerf. I wonder if it shoots anything like a like actual good Nerf guns because we had, I have a Captain America one and it, it's okay. So here's the weapon of mass destruction. What is all this, what packaging? Oh, I don't understand. I'm so confused. Please help me. My hand is too big. Uh, oh. oh. So I put it on and it's like, it expands. So now I got these things loaded up. Oh, that's not bad. Okay, so Brian is my target. Ready for this? Ready? Ready? That's that accurate. Goes to my eye, dude. That's what I was aiming for. That's I accurate. Why are you aiming for my face, dude? That stings. That's got a little. <laughs> this isn't a bad gift. Although I don't see the significance in this besides. Oh, that's cool. Let's see how good this aim is. Yeah. Ah! Oh, I can't get my hand out of it. Ah! You're this thing? Nervous, dude. You're getting I, I'm, I was getting claustrophobic for real, <laughs> dude. Ah. Okay, so we have a lighted hover ball, the indoor ball that glides. It's a half ball. That's not a ball. It's not even anything. Now with LED lights. Oh, great. Because that's what a ball needs. They're doing anything to get kids to play outside these days. <laughs> no, not even outside. Indoor. Oh, now they're like, just please move around a little bit. Why not play with an actual ball? It'll most likely go much farther. I don't know, I, 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 sh I can't knock this product until I try it though, right? You take a look at the bottom of it and there's absolutely no fan or propulsion of any type whatsoever. It's just a smooth plastic surface. Just a smooth plastic surface. So what that means is that it absolutely doesn't hover and the only thing that the battery is used for is to light the thing up. I mean, how hard do you have to kick it? You no, know, the directions said turn it on. You're right. <laughs> Why is there an on button? There's, there's, there's an on and off button inside the plate. Yeah, see, you just hit it and it turns on. In, in their defense, it does slide pretty well, but this is on an incredibly smooth surface, right? I don't think you'll be able to play with this. Oh, you can't play with it outdoor. It's only indoor. Yeah. Okay, so let's try it. I mean, curve action. Oh, <laughs> okay, that didn't work too well. 
How is it not good? You almost got embarrassed, bro. Oh, dang, he knows what he's doing. Oh, I'm just gonna do this, dude, because it's wrong. You can't raise the ball. Oh! You didn't get that, did you? Uh, no. Good. No. So it didn't count. It didn't count. Alright, so redo because it didn't count. It didn't count. Okay, so that's not that's not terrible. That's not terrible. It was more fun than I thought it was gonna be. What is this kinetic foam stretch model? What will you do? Okay, is this just gonna be like a disaster? You got a package inside a package. You're like what? There's another package inside a package. I literally just took off the package. What's the package inside the package inside the package? There's another package inside the package. What? <laughs> Inside a package, inside a package. Yes, I think we're in there. Ooh, that's weird. Okay, so it doesn't leave residue, so that's cool. Here, oh, it smells. Mm. Okay, here we go. Got the foam out. What should I make? A dinosaur. A dinosaur? A velociraptor. A vo there you go. How detailed do you think I'm gonna get with this thing? This is really weird feeling though. I'm not gonna lie, this is a really weird feeling. Oh. I got this, dude. I'm making it happen, man. I'm making it happen. Okay, the legs didn't turn out how I anticipated, but there's my dinosaur. He even stands. Look that way, dude. There we go. <laughs> my little dinosaur. Okay, let me give that to you. Now that the dinosaur's dead, let's find the cause. Oh, it wasn't dead, but now it is, because I cut off the head. What was the cause? A uh, decapitation. Despicable Me Fart Blaster. Fart Blaster. Joke mode. To play a joke, press and hold the trigger for a few seconds. When the light chamber starts flashing red and green, release the trigger. Joke mode is now activated. Place the fart blaster in a desired location. After 20 seconds, it will light up and make a fart sound. Don't you think someone's gonna be able to see if this is, that this is the cause of the fart blaster? Of the fart noise, you know? <laughs> <laughs> I didn't expect the little guy at the end. So I'm gonna hold now. In 20 seconds, so let's wait. Dun -da -da -dun. <laughs> oh my gosh, it went, all, it, it went all crazy. Let's see if we can fool anyone with that, that special trick. How do you know I was? <laughs> I wasn't. I just apparated. Dude, that's gross. Just don't stand. No, it's stinky! Stinky! I think that might be a good gift for your grandpa. Cause it, you know, he probably likes farting. Oh, more foot massagers. Wait, it's one thing. Like you can't separate them. You can't separate them. Look at this. You cannot separate it. You can just give someone these and be like, they're shoes, dude! You're supposed to hop everywhere. How do you turn it on? Where's the battery? How does it vibrate? Answer the second question first. So in here, we put the AA batteries. There's not even like a cover for this. <laughs> not even a cover, that's just how it is. There should be a button on the side. You, you hear that? An aggressive that's a, vibration. That's an aggressive vibration, man. Turn that puppy on, baby. Turn that puppy on. That just tickles. That just tickles me. <laughs> Actually, I don't feel it. I just, that's not a massage to me. <laughs> I don't, I, I, I'm not a fan of the tickle vibration technique. If someone in your family likes vibrations, <laughs> that gift is good for them. And their feet, just their feet, that's it. That's all, next product, that's all, that's what I said, no. What the heck is this? Oh, okay, I didn't see the cat. 
on the package right there. I was like, what the crap? What kind of section are you in, dude? As seen on TV, electronic motion toy feather whirl. This is bizarre, I'm not gonna lie. Smarty cat. Let's see what this thing does. There's a little button on the side right here and let's press it. Oh, that's just weird, dude. It's like a little animal that's alive. Is this a human toy or is this a cat toy? Because I feel like I'm just as amused as a cat would be. It's like very random. <laughs> Do you think the guys will have any idea what this is and what its use is? No one here is a cat person. Right? No one here is a cat person. So let's 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 take it around and see what they think this is. Maybe they're a lot smarter than we think they are. <laughs> what now? <laughs> what do you think it is? Guess. That's Guess. It. I Guess. feel like it's like a toy for a cat. You read it, didn't you? I promise I didn't. Promise. You read it. Where are they? Where are they? All right, if you have a cat in your family, get that for your cat for Christmas. <laughs> what the heck is this? See you later. Cookies and cream, hazelnut. Ah, oh, I'm allergic to hazelnut, dude. I'm allergic. But that looks so good if it wasn't hazelnut. Really? You think that looks, I thought that was kind of a weird cookies and cream. Like, I mean, like, what would you put this on though? You know what I mean? Maybe this is in place of Nutella. Maybe for all those Nutella people, you're like, hey, you've had enough Nutella this Christmas. Maybe you try something else over the holidays. This could be it. So maybe if I, maybe I can try the cookies and cream part. <laughs> I really should have washed my finger first. Dude, that's not bad. No, no, there's definitely hazelnut in it. <laughs> I'm having a reaction. Luckily, I'm not that allergic to hazelnut. I just get a really, really itchy throat. <laughs> Let's see if anyone else is willing to try this. Do you like hazelnut? Yes. Look at this. Hazelnut cookies and cream. It's not, it's not. <laughs> he just doesn't trust me. It's good, dude. Well, you have given him fart-scented paper before. Yes, so. and you That's wanted true. me to eat a tarantula, so I don't know. Just eat it. It's fine. It's normal. <laughs> he just seriously doesn't trust me. <laughs> Oh, that's delicious. What's the catch? Because it's really good. No catch. Goodbye. <laughs> I don't know. I can... Taste this. What is it? Is it a tarantula? <laughs> Zoning out over here. No, it's not a tarantula. Don't read what it is, dude. I'm afraid. <laughs> no, you're fine. <laughs> it's actually really good. It is really good. What is it? Cookies and cream and chocolate. Yeah? Oh. Dude, this guy knows what he's talking about, right? It's better than tarantula. <laughs> if you're not aware, Jfred tried a tarantula in my Amazon video. Are you sure it's edible? Yeah. Absolutely, 100%. <laughs> oh my gosh! Oh! Oh! <laughs> I just saw him puke in the sink. If you got non-allergic people to hazelnut, get it for them for Christmas. <laughs> I'm gonna die. <laughs> the Grocery Gang. What in the name? Surprise grocery inside. What? Oh, grocery. So it's like bad food from the world of trash pack. If I can get this right, we got a can here, right? That has collectible moldy, oh my gosh, moldy groceries. At what point does a company think like something like this will sell? Am I, am I missing something here? Are you guys like big fans of molding uh, groceries? Is it, is, does it come with a mystery item? I'm afraid, dude. Let's find out what it is. Can you see that? It's like a tiny little apple. Yeah, it's a fuzzy little apple. It's actually fuzzy. That pleases me. Also in here, we have a pie, bad popcorn, and some kind of rubber thing. I mean, what is that? I don't know what that is. Oh my gosh, there are so freaking many. Holy junk. Mom, please give me the gross groceries. Please, I need them, Mom. Now, just go play with the old food in the fridge. <laughs> <laughs> Not to knock this too much. I mean, it's, you know, it's quality. I just don't understand it. <laughs> Next product. <laughs> Is a ring? Oh, it's a cast puzzle. Mm -hmm. Can you take it apart? Oh, didn't you try to do, get me to do this with like a dollar store thing? You couldn't do it. And I couldn't do it. I just like legit couldn't do it. And then Gunner came in and like did it in like half a second. And he was like, what? Oh, that was a puzzle? And I was like, what the heck, Gunner? <laughs> so now that I've got it out of the package, what is the goal here? I have to try and get it out? Oh, I see. So that this ring right here is open. So somehow, Oh, I pull it in, I can push it in here, 
and then I have to like potentially find my way around this maze now. Oh, cause there's two sides. There's this side that I have to worry about and then there's this side and they don't match up. This is hurting my brain, dude. I'm already stuck, man. Of course it. Come on, man. I'm so close. I don't think so. Yes, I am. I'm very close. Oh my gosh. My patience has paid off. Wait, but I'm way far away now. Oh my word. <gasps> oh, what? I just, I just, I stop, it, 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 it reset. Dude, I'm gonna have to spend some time on that later. If you guys have got puzzled people in your family getting that for Christmas. Guys, make sure you click this video right there. It is the last Walmart gifts, strange ones at that, that we did just as funny. And maybe you might be able to get some stuff for your family this holiday. Also, click that up there to subscribe because we do videos similar to this three times a week, Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday. Hope you enjoyed it. High five.